International Socialist Network. And now another segment of Really with Heidi and Rachel. Really, people? Really? You're gonna sit in a trench, waist deep in mud? Really? Really? I mean, really? You're gonna be exploited by the rich people when this war won't even affect you? Really? You've been crawling under guard for Really? At the beck and call of officers who don't even know what they're doing? Really? You think that's a good idea? Really? And how do you spend Christmas? Playing football? Really? You were just killing these kids literally two days ago and now you're BFFs? Really? How about you stop fighting and realize that you have a lot in common with the other guy? I mean, you're just gonna ignore the fact that you are literally the same as the guy you are killing? Really? Not gonna acknowledge that the ruling class is just using you to fight your fellow man? Really? I mean, really? We'll be right back. Hey, hello, it's Allie and Hannah here with a special offer for all you lovely people. We have a special 16 CD package of all your favorite soldier songs. Sing the good old tunes and express your disappointment with the ruling class. Reminisce about the glory days, dropping like flies in trenches. This CD includes some of your favorite tunes, including Forward Joe Soap's Army. And hanging on the old barbed wire. I saw him sitting in. And you can't forget the classics The Red Flag. Traitor Sneer will keep. All this can be yours for $19.99 plus shipping and handling. Act now and you'll receive your very own traditional communist flag and London bobblehead. We'll see you soon. And now, another segment of Winners and Losers with Heidi and Rachel. <laughs> Winners, Russia and the Revolution, and the Allies. Losers, the Germans. I mean, they lost the war and they were at a perfect point for a revolution to overthrow the ruling class. Did they take the chances? No. Winners, Karl Lipnecht and Rosa Luxemburg. Thank God someone has sense. Yesterday, on January 13th, 1919, they led their followers in the Spartacus uprising in Berlin. Unfortunately, the so-called socialist democrats crushed the uprising. If they were really socialists, they'd join our cause. Like the French, they're striking and refusing to fight. So who's the real loser here? The working class. I'm Hannah. And I'm Allie. And here's what you need to know. In the February Revolution, we screamed freedom and justice. Then Krinsky took power with his empty promises, but didn't stop the war. We got you involved in the Petrograd Soviet, and now we know what we have to do. We have to overthrow Krinsky. Our fearless leaders, Lenin and Trotsky, have made it possible, but you need to know your part. Know these slogans. All power to the Soviets. All land to the peasants. Stop war now. And most importantly, bread, land, and peace. This, the inevitable revolution, we cannot fail. Live from the news desk, it's Hannah Pennington. Woo! We have live action of the White Army versus the Red Army. Take us there, Rachel. Hey, Hannah. You know what they say, better right than white. And we are most certainly right. Here you'll see the White Army, backed by the Western Allies, are attacking Lenin, Trotsky, and the Red Army. Let's watch what's happening. Bread, land, and peace. Ah! <laughs> we win! Let's see how Lenin feels about it. Let us now proceed to create the socialist order. <laughs> this has been the International Socialist News Network. <laughs>